Nasrallah State was created in October 1, 1996 by the Abacha government from Labour and Plata State. It is located in the north central region of Nigeria. And with agriculture being the mainstay of its economy, it produces a wide variety of food crops throughout the year, which are then sold to other parts of the country. Nasrallah State is the highest producer of foods in the region, second to Bainwe State. Food production is now under threat in the state with the increasing incidence of clashes between farmers and headsmen in the region. From Plateau, Nasarawa, Bainwe State, the story is the same as farmers constantly complain of their farm produce being damaged by roaming cattle heads from the north across the region. With these three states, especially Nasara, being the highest producers of food, it is becoming increasingly imperative for government to broker peace between both sets of agriculturalists in order for them to coexist without rancor. The traditional head of Doma, one of the local government was hit by the headsman farmers' crisis, believes this is a way forward. It's an easy camp. Because as long as the farmers are in the field, we have our farmers are in the farm, there's no place about it. We've been able to, luckily for us here, manage the relationship. The country happens to be for all of us. Whether you're a farmer, you're a cattle herder, you're a civil servant, as long as you're a Nigerian, this country belongs to all of us. Uh, the disposition to hurt somebody by destroying what he sees, must be avoided by all persons who practice any form of economic activity at all. So, farmers must have their farm, must be able to go to farm and cultivate their farm produce safely without anybody destroying them. The herders must have an opportunity to rear their animals without a hindrances without losing them, without their being destroyed, and they too, without destroying the economic fortune of any Nigerian at all. And not just getting a grazing reserve, but being able to enforce the use of the grazing reserve. And relatedly, there must be castle boots across the entire country. We try to dialogue between the farmers and the herdsmen to ensure, first and foremost, that there is peace. Because uh, uh, there has always been encroachment uh, on farmland by the headsmen. So we beg our people to maintain peace. Otherwise, there will have been uh, frequent uh, violence. If we try to express that by talking to them, to see reasons. The need for farmers to maintain peace and for the need for the headsmen to maintain this. In Yapar Waka, Munzo, Seriki Muna, Imuna Magana, Yataramu, and Akira Pulani, and Ima Ganadis. Bisa Kangona and the Suna Tata Kamunashi, the Doya, the Agushi, the Mazara Duka, Son Gamadish. I get a Munabama Kuli, Suna Salema, Yara Muhanu, Munakara Kura Kaimona, Shiana Bada Kurana Samun Zoman Lafia. Some of the farmers appeal to their colleagues for calm, but urge the government to act urgently to preserve their farms, which are their only source of livelihood. Sophia Ogezi, Tivison News, Doma, Nasara State.